Testing, testing, all right. Hey, everybody. Uh-oh, uh-oh, volume, 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 volume. Oh, there we go, okay. That was a close. I almost blew my eardrums out. All right. Well, it is 1.43 a.m. I'm probably going to go to bed pretty soon. And, um, guys, I'm just going to tell you, I feel like utter crapola. Um... Oh, also, I noticed this the edge of the screen looked kind of weird, so let me see if I can fix that. All right, maybe that helped. I don't know. So, guys, um... Okay, a ton of stuff I gotta put in... My storage. Um, but yeah, guys, I feel like total trash. Um... I went to everyone's favorite high-class department store, Target, yesterday, and, uh... I already caught COVID from there twice. What is this? I think we already have this. Yeah. Um, so I sprayed my little antiseptic spray up my nose and in the back of my throat. And then, oh, that's nice. We got a little congrats for that. How special. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, honestly, I don't even remember if I told you guys last time that Sammy moved out or if he moved out between last episode and this time. But he's gone. I, I feel like I talked about this before. I just don't remember. But anyway, now Avora is officially our only remaining starter. But yeah, I'm, I'm just, um, but ever since I sprayed that thing in the back of my throat, maybe it was, that was a bad idea. Maybe it like upset the, my throat culture or something. But um, I just feel terrible. I just have a sore throat and my, my body's aching like crazy. And I don't really know why, but, um, suffice to say, I am definitely sick. So we're just gonna, I'm gonna be really low energy today, um, so I'm sorry about that, but I, I gotta record today. Um, I don't want to time travel whatever so I'm, it's just gonna be a kind of crappy episode so i apologize about that and it's gonna be a short one too i i know this is like the fifth episode in a row i've been like oh i said i was gonna do activate mystery time but not today but seriously i just can't today it's just not a i'm just not in a i just can't <laughs> i just can't even think about farming and i'm pretty busy with um I'm really trying to finish my uh, seasonal creature guard for spring. Yeah, that's true, bitch. Sorry, not bitch. Love of my life. So we didn't answer when I called her last night. When I asked her what happened, she said she was sleeping. Apparently she was starting to live by the proverb, the other bird gets the worm. But she got up so early yesterday morning, she was fast asleep by dinner time. My senses tell me, I don't see what the good that proverb is because she all she got was sleepy. Interesting. What a nerd. Hey, Zoe. Oh, I was just taking a break. You see, people are always looking at an idol like me. If I don't have some rest every now and then, I'm sure to get all tired out. Ah, perfect timing. Ah, oh, it's you again. Seems like we run into each other a lot. We must like the same stuff if we're always in the same place. Guess that means we're friends. It's just a coincidence. I think it's more than a coincidence, but whatever. 
if you ever feel like becoming friends with me, Geoff, I just might give you a second chance. Hey, Tony. I like things you do. Hello there, Geoff. You look delightfully carefree today. I, on the other hand, am as busy as ever. But no matter, I can only find time to chat with a friend. I heard that Geoff and Brett seem, seem to are bound by so... What? Okay. Geoff and Brett seem to are bound so well to the point that it seems fake. Don't blame me, I'm just the messenger. So, is it true? Might be true. Well, there you go. You learn something new every day. That's great. I wish they'd invite me too sometime. In your dreams, buddy. This is where we have like two bushes right next to each other. Alright. Well, we never ever have to take a class ever in our lives. So that's nice. I feel like I looked up some of the new bugs and fish, but none of it, like, none of it stayed in my brain. So I'm not really going to hunt for anything today. I think there was like a sea creature that I need to look at, look for. It's like a, I don't know, like a tuna maybe? I don't know. But I'm not sure. I can't remember when Sammy moved, so I don't know if we have a new student in our midst. Hey, Geoff, white long fish. I want to organize my bedroom, so I began by sorting through my old magazines. One of them caught my eye, so I decided to flip through it. Hey, are you listening? Not really. Next thing I knew, it was midnight, and I read a whole words of the issues. <laughs> okay. Hey, Geoff, how is it going? Hey, you'll never guess what I saw. Marty was having fun on the shopping avenue. If you ask me, I prefer this old saying, the more the merrier. Maybe next time I should ask Marty to hang out with me. Alright, well. I'm gonna hunt for a new student, I guess. Uh, and I need to do my hair at some point, too. Good lord, there's just so much to do. Hey, Brett. I was kind of hoping Brett would ask me out again sometime, but he does not seem interested. There's this one girl who I got on with. She's more like a boy. I'm so fun. Okay. Oh, he's stuck. He can't figure out how to get on the bench. Poor guy. God, I'm so tired. Yeah, this is really going to be a short episode. Like... If I have my way, it's going to be like less than a half hour, <laughs> but we'll see what happens. I do want to keep my uh, friendships up. Let me do my little ram watch. Sorry. All right, Aurora needs a little work, and Brett's actually looking pretty good. We'll see. Okay, so wait. Um, Sammy lived here. Oh, okay. Looks like we do have someone new. Nervous. Oh, it's Wyatt. Okay. Wyatt's okay. I do like his house. It's very, like, uh... It's a really... It's, like, very rustic. It's, like, uh... It really makes me think of, like, uh, the Wild West and stuff. Alright. Hey there. I'm Wyatt. You are? Alright. Really? Jaw, huh? Well, sounds good to me. It's been nice talking to you. Sorry for my bad southern accent. Hey, Joff. The beautiful blue sky makes me happy to be alive. This may sound kind of immature, but I still sleep with my teddy bear at night. It's just not just any teddy bear, you see. We've been through a lot together, me and him. All right. A real man never forgets his true friends. All right. <laughs> this is hard. Why well, yeah, already seems like a very strange character. Kind of looking forward to getting to know him a little more. Hey, Geoff. Beautiful. All right, you just said that. On regular days, no matter how early I go to bed, it's always so difficult getting up. But whenever I day off, I get up so early, no matter how late I go to bed. All right. My teachers are always telling me to stop arriving so late. They should just make every day a day off. Then I wouldn't have any problem getting up in time for school. I don't know about that logic, my friend. 
Yeah, wow, he's really happy to be alive. Someone dug up some kind of weird bowl at the edge of the schoolyard the other day. Tony and the others are saying that might be some kind of valuable antique. I managed to take a look at it, too. Alright. It looks exactly like a bowl I had as a kid. I wonder what ever happened to it. I, I don't know, guys. What do you think about him? I kind of like him, but I don't know if... Hey, Joff. You're not too busy, right? Alright. You want to do something together? Sure. Alright, I knew you'd be up for it. Let's go wild. I think I'll, um... I don't think I'm gonna go out with him, but he I think I would be friends with him. He seems pretty nifty. I do like a southern gentleman. But yeah, I'm almost done with the uh, spring graphic. I know it's like three weeks late. Not three weeks late, but like the creatures came out three weeks ago, so. I think everyone's given up on me ever finishing it, but I'm almost done. I really like you, Brett. I mean, you didn't give me a chance to tell you that, but okay. It's really weird never having to go to a single class ever again. I don't really know what to do now. Oh man, I'm just exhausted. The past few weeks have just been miserable, honestly. Um, I think life is gradually getting better. Okay, honestly, <laughs> I missed what she said. All I could say was, so I, all I caught was some conflict in some situations. So, I don't know. I think she was saying maybe he's also self-paced or like likes change or something. I don't know. Who knows? Um, let's go here. I don't know. Go clothes shopping. All right, what do we got? Explorer pants, polka dot tights. Nothing interesting. I do, however, have to make sure that, um... Gotta make sure that, uh... Well, first I need to finish this episode, and then I also need to make sure that I have all the outfits I need for my little... For my little task. Um, I think Layton has talked about the requirements for, like, what require, like what counts as a full outfit, but we'll have to see. All right, let's put a lot of this back. Although, I don't know. Some of it I kind of want to keep around just in case, like, I change my mind or I want to include it again. Magic circle walls I won't forget about. Neither will I forget about that. Or, or that. Uh, these two I'm kind of tempted to keep around, though. I guess I don't really need the magical chemical shelf. But the, well, I guess I won't forget about the forest wardrobe as a possibility. Alright, what about... I really want a hammock, but I don't... Did I ever buy a spare? I thought I did, but I guess not. I don't see one. I guess not. Hmm. Okay, so another thing we gotta do is check out my outfits here. So let me... Okay, so a baseball uniform. We would need baseball pants for that, and we don't have that. Um, for a biker uniform, we would need a biker helmet. I'm not sure if we have that or not. Okay, we have a camo helmet. Okay, we do have a biker helmet. We have a 
red gear biker top and we have leather biker pants. Okay, so we do have a biker outfit. We, I think we have a full camo outfit too. Because we have camo shoes, camo pants, a camo vest, and a camo helmet here. I don't have a dirty uh, thing. I have an explorer outfit. Do I have a pirate outfit? Do you have a pirate hat? Um, question is if I have an, a pirate top. Okay, I have a cowboy shirt that's gonna matter later. Okay, I have a pirate outfit top too. And I know I have pirate pants somewhere. Um, for a cowboy outfit, I have a cowboy hat, a cowboy shirt. Oh, you know what? I don't think I have cowboy pants. I don't think I do. Oh, I do. Perfect. Okay. So let's see. We can do biker. We can do camo. We can do explorer. We can do pirate. And we can do cowboy. And that should do it. Uh, that's five, and we only need three. So, you know, some guides say you need four, but um, apparently Lane looks into it and you just need three. So we should be fine with that. Um, I kind of hope Wyatt leaves me alone at some point. Okay, so we're fine in that respect. Zoe's thirsty. Lila probably still wants mushrooms for like the 8 billionth time. Okay, if we just like stay outside for a solid minute, Wyatt will probably get bored and leave. Um, I'll grab this Marguerite to give to Aurora. Please and thank you. Oh, you know what? There's like something hiding in flowers that I need to look for. And that was it. Perfect. <laughs> okay, that was way easier than I thought it would be. Brilliant. Alright. Um. <laughs> Alright. Listen. Hmm, I don't know. Should we trust Wyatt with where our secret savings account is? This seems very dicey. Also, this tree did not grow. Dang it. Oh well, whatever. Is it money? I think it's money love. Incantation. Money. Love. A, there's a few creatures you need to get. There's like a snail and a tuna and there's like a couple of mystery time things that are new. Um, I didn't see any berries so I suppose I could hop off at the um, haunted house here but I'm going to just double check to make sure there aren't any around before I enter. No tulips around for Brett. That kind of sucks. Oh, he's done. Whatever. That sure was fun. 
It's at times like these that time seems to stand still. But you think we should call it a day soon? Alright, sure, whatever. Get lost, I don't care. Alright, that was a little rude. I had a fun hangout with you, Wyatt, and I hope you, you know, continue your, uh, oh, here's some cranberries. Beautiful. Continue your, uh, your pleasant day. I was trying to think of a southern term to use, but I can Okay, I'm gonna use these tulips to steal Brett's heart. I think I'm gonna skip the friendship incantation because it's clearly doing jack shit. I have no idea what those fucking incantations do, but it really doesn't seem like it does anything at all. Is that a bee or a ladybug? It's a ladybug. I do need a honeybee, though. How is Eric teleporting so much? That's all the berries that are around here, though. But yeah, I'm a little, so... I mean, the another big reason I'm not doing mystery time today is because I'm, I'm like, in a weird sleep schedule right now where, I mean, yesterday I went to bed at, like, 4 p.m., and I woke up at 2 a.m., which was 10 hours of sleep. So I... And, and if I, so if I keep it up like that, I won't be able to do the next mystery, which is like you have to you have to do it at night, which is like seven seven p.m. to four a.m., which is like the exact time I'll be asleep right now. So I figure if I start it a little later, I'll have a little more time to get my sleep schedule in a place where I can actually do it. stuff, to be honest. But I guess that's good, because we don't really have a good way of making spare cash at the moment. Ugh, these berries, these strawberries. That's a total ripoff, but at least the uh, cranberries sold for a lot. Alright. So, I think the only other things we need to do are... Um... I need to... I need to butter up uh, Aurora and Brett. And I need to... finish the episode with Daisy. And then, um... I think that's it, though. I really, I'm sorry, this is kind of a whoop of an episode. I just, I really, really do not feel good. I'm really only playing today out of necessity. But I, I appreciate you watching anyway if you are. And, uh, you know, if you aren't, I appreciate that too. In, in some way. I don't know. Uh, okay. Is Aurora at home or is she at Lover's Point? He's not home. You know, I'm not really going to be able to, like, show any other hair for the rest of the month <laughs> because of... Well, I guess towards the end of the month I might be able to, but I, I should probably try out some different hair today. Even if I really don't want to change the hair that I really love. I really love this current style, but whatever. Alright, give me a purple cool cut, please. I don't know how this is going to turn out. I, I'm not sure. 
I don't think I'm gonna like it. Oh, you know, that's really not bad. I'd like to change into a different outfit for it, but overall that's really not bad. He's gonna whack me one sometime soon. I was waiting for you to ask me, buddy. Cute lamp. Celebrity lamp. It's kind of nice, too. I thought it looked kind of cruddy and I liked that quality, but apparently it's the celebrity lamp, so I don't know. Absolutely nothing worthwhile. So I guess the real question is, um... I don't know exactly how this, uh, thing with, um... Okay, I think we have all these. I don't really know how the, um... the fashion requirement works. I'm gonna actually look that up real quick. I'll be right back. Okay. He's, Leighton says, and he's dug into the code here. He says, switch sets each day, at least four unique sets over the 10 days. It will check if you need to have the set equipped when saving. Oh no, he'll check if, or if the track's changing during the day, but I'm guessing it checks what you have equipped when you load the save and it increments the counter if it's a different set than yesterday. You, um, it wants a full set. It can be a shirt. It can be a set that only has shirts and pants. But if the set contains a hat or shoes, then it needs them too. So, uh, okay, that's irrelevant because we don't have any sets that. If I had the dirty shirt top, I would be able to use that. Or, or I I could use the wild set, but that seems dicey because it doesn't have pants. Um, okay, I think I get it. Um, I think I should be wearing something when I stop playing today, though, just because, like, just if we're gonna start it like this. So I should keep that in mind. I guess I'll wear the cowboy, uh, set. I, should, I guess I'll probably uh, have to take some clothes out of my storage. So maybe this is a little more involved than I thought. Or maybe I don't really have to do that. Maybe I can just... I could just start with the Explorer set. Because I have all of that stuff. Already been a half hour. I'm really not feeling so hot. Give me a second. I'm gonna turn the fan on. I'm fucking burning up a little bit. Sorry about that. I just, I just bumped the mic. I'm sorry if that caused bad noise.
All right, I think that's gonna be it for Brett and me today. I just don't have a lot of time. Um, oh, I guess I should go in here though. about how nice the men are in this town are? I just can't talk more highly of them. How did I get so lucky? I get so much from everyone, and nobody ask, ever asks for anything in return. Some of them I realize don't treat everyone the same. I've heard stories from other people. The truly good people are genuinely nice to everyone they meet. But those who change depending on who they're dealing with it seems fake to me. Might be nice to one person and not to others. Hmm. Do they think they want something? Do you think they want something from me? Yeah, I think they want something. But who would want to be friends with such people? I seem to have misplaced my kettle. I'm not sure how it happened during the move, but somehow it did, so that might make things complicated. I guess I could just boil water, but that seems like, I don't know. And then I wonder, like, about the, the ramifications of microwaving water. Like, I try not to microwave food when I have an alternative because I know it, like, zaps out the nutrients or something. I don't know if that's just propaganda. That's just how I've perceived it. But then, like, water doesn't really have nutrients, so is it really bad to microwave it? I don't know. Comment below if you have an opinion. There's something buried there or something? Why can't I... Um, okay. Well, I think that certainly uh, indicates that the tree is not gonna grow there anyway. I guess it's too close to the path or something. Is it too late to dig this up? Everything is fresh and new, and even a short-tempered guy like me calms down a bit. Don't you think that? What are you waiting for, Joff? Speak now, or forever hold your peace. <laughs> can I pick this up? Oh, I can! That's awesome. I didn't know that. Okay. Well, let's try over here. That's why it didn't grow in that other space. I don't know. Oh my god, you still you still can't put one up there? I'm so confused. No, there's rooms. So why should, why can't we put a uh, flower there? That was very confusing. Alright, 
I think I'm gonna tell Brett goodbye for now. Do you want to give- oh no. Oh, I meant to uh, give him an item. since Wyatt, um, I guess since Wyatt moved in, I will, um, try to put on a cowboy outfit. So I have this, and there's also a cowboy shirt in the other. Cowboy pants. Okay. I also need like a pirate's outfit, yeah. And uh I'll have to pick some stuff out of um, out of my inventory to store temporarily to make room for some of this outfit stuff. Or I guess I could just use the trash can like I've been doing. <laughs> I guess there's not really a downside to doing that. I might as well. Let's just, yeah, let's just do that. Way easier than messing with everything. All right. Um, well, I will play with these. I guess loafers will be a good, uh... Not much better. Wow. Is there another option? Open Western shirt. I think I have that in, in there. I don't think this really goes with purple hair, to be honest. That's so much better. Okay, that just like made the outfit. Beautiful. Time for some square dancing. Oops. To back into Aurora's good graces. 
before I stop playing for another three days. Alright, these can all go in here. I'll keep that on hand. Alright, so this is one outfit. Now I don't I don't really think this is the case. I don't think you really I don't think the game really cares if you start in an outfit. But uh, just in case. But basically these the situation is you need to uh, for ten days you need to rotate outfits. And they need to be complete outfits. And supposedly they need to they might need to include at least a top and pants. So I have I have five options that I can rotate through. I have a biker outfit, uh, explorer outfit, pirate outfit, cowboy outfit, and camo outfit. Did I say one of those twice? I don't know. Perfect, we got a snail. should hang out. I don't know what we'll do, because we already have a uh, max friendship now. But maybe I'll just, like, take her out for some noodles in the woods. Oh, there's another snail. Cute. Oh, that was a huge snail. Wonderful. Is that a, another snail just floating in the water? Wow. The wonders of nature will never cease to amaze even the most seasoned of bug hunters. He was just like floating on the water. It was like magical. Let's, uh, let's turn in these snails, and then, um, I wonder if we can get Brett to play something with us. Every time I check on Layton's tool, it seems like Aurora and Brett are just not, like, getting any closer to each other, so I don't really know what's wrong. Tootin' guys, appreciate it. Oh, I guess we should um stop by the store and see if Malila wants everything, anything, since uh we're gonna be like I'm gonna try to do mystery time next time. I'm really hoping I'll feel better. Um, but I guess I shouldn't 
put that expectation on myself and we should just see how it goes. Um, because if it turns out we only have one mystery time for all of April, then I'm gonna be pretty tight on cash. But yeah, I'm sorry this is not a super exciting episode. I don't even know what on earth I'm gonna call it, because hardly anything happened in it. Well, actually, there is one thing I need to do. Oh, wait, did I... Did I give him the carrot caterpillar? No, I didn't. do it with that. I do actually like the purple hair with this outfit because like the the open western shirt has like a faint purple hue on the inner shirt so it kind of matches. All right there is one thing I need to uh one thing I need to take care of a little paperwork. I need to formally explain to Aurora why her play thing has officially no more. They forgot about this whole thing. Alright, so this is a little abbreviated, but basically the gist is this. To Aurora. Samu was making some alarming threats about coming forward about certain deeds by certain people, so I took care of him for you. He won't be bothering us anymore, but I'm sorry. I'll miss him too. From Geoff. Alright, and that's that. Wait, I don't think we even got noodles. That's what I was hoping to do. Ah, screw it. I'm really tired. specific items, but I think we have an orange melee. I think we just got one. Yep, we do. Cool, cool. I have no idea. Like, there's a bunch of materials that, like, it seems like you never need. Maybe, maybe they're used for some mysteries, but Black Rose Thorn, I think, is never used for any, uh, I don't think it's used for any spells. Alright, well with that I'm gonna close out this episode. I'm I'm really sorry it was well, let's show Aurora her our new little love nest and see if she likes it. But other than that, I think we're gonna call it quits. I'm sorry this episode was really low key, but I am not feeling so hot. So I really gotta take care of myself. But I didn't want to just end everything and have Aurora break up with us and then leave.
We really do need a music player in here, but overall I think it's a great little room. Hope that Aurora likes it. I don't know, it's it's a little, I don't know, now that I'm looking at it, it seems a little cramped. Um, I might try to redesign it at some point, but overall I like it pretty well. But uh, yeah. Maybe we don't need this bird bath, but I kind of like it. I don't know. But anyway, thanks for all uh, for watching. Um, as always, um, like I said, I know this episode wasn't super hip and happening, but hopefully I'll make up for it. And we'll have if things go according to plan. We will have a a string of ten rather low key episodes. But I'll I'll see if I can still find some mischief to get up to there. So yeah, just a just a heads up if you if you follow along, the next ten episodes will probably be a lot shorter because I'm just going to be playing every single day. Just hopping on, doing my stuff, and then hopping off. Alright, well, I'll catch you later. Thanks a lot, and take care. Feel free to comment if you want to, but no pressure at all. Um, but yeah, peace. Bye for now.